Uh, obviously, the markets are not going the way we expected today uh, so far. I mean, TBLT did gap up to 308, and it's just giving it up. So I'm actually um, going to be averaging here, um, personally, looking at looking at it like a buying opportunity. It's completely oversold. The RSI is, is fucking 873. So I'm just going to go ahead and average. It's fine by me. Uh, VDU is it's flat, one cent down. So, I mean, and it's pre-market. You can't even really go by that. The surprising one was Chimerics. I mean, they're just, they stand to make 300 million off their fucking pox sale. And uh, that ain't going nowhere, monkey pox. But, uh, so... A little bit of a buying opportunity there. It's trading under all three. Well, let me change this to 15 minute actually. One day, 15 minute. Okay, so 181 would be probably the bottom for support uh, on Chimerix, but it's trading under the 18 and the 48 MA. So we're looking at 192, 196. So. 181 to 196 is potentially what it's going to be opening around. Uh, TBLT, that's like I said, that's way oversold. The bottom on that's 235 for the 200 MA. Um, I'm still confident in that play. The float is tiny as f. Yeah, marijuana stocks are green, but kind of barely. PSNY, so Polestar. Down five percent, but I uh, I wrote covered calls on that at for twelve fifty, so I don't really care. And I'm going to be writing some selling some puts, not buying, but selling some uh, ten fifty puts on that. They pay about forty three cents, and that's a twenty percent drop that I'm covering myself on. Twelve to ten is twenty percent virtually. That's a little bit less, but it's like twelve thirty three divide ten fifty. 17%. Okay, so I'm giving myself 17% downside, but I'm going to put around 43 cents per share in my pocket on open. Uh, if you did that for six months, a similar trade, you could turn 10 grand into over 20 grand. So you could literally 10, uh, 10 2x, you could 2x, so 100% on, on your account. And I'll take some slow gains. That's fine. I'll take some safer, slow plays if the market wants to be fucking bipolar and be super bullish on Friday and shit's opening red on Monday. Um, whatever. Go, you know, go do your Roe v. Wade protest. But I'm not going to be... Something I wanted to mention. Someone told me to pile into EF or EVFM. Uh, it's a female contraceptive penny stock that ran about 100% this morning, and it's already down to 65. Let me put it to you like this. Condoms are free at almost any health center. Just, just free. Because governments want you to have protection and prevent STDs and STIs and, you know, unwanted pregnancies. So if, if I'm a female contraceptive in my business, that's my business. And my con and my competition is free. I think my business is kind of shitty, or has a dim outlook. That's probably why it was a penny stock. You could do whatever you want. There's some volume there, but just me personally, uh, I don't care. If I miss it, if it rips and I miss, I really don't give a shit. Because uh, I'm going with my gun on this one. I think maybe a whale is moving this news of Roe v. Wade is moving it, uh, like whatever. What are they hiding? I, I don't know what they're hiding. I thought we were talking about gun control. Now we're talking about Roe v. What, what is next? I don't know. <laughs> um, I'm actually going to try and get out of the market as much as possible today because uh, I, I just I don't like what I'm seeing. I don't want to lose money. I'm, and I'm just going to... I'm going to chill. Chill on the sidelines. See what happens. Maybe go back to bed for fucking an hour and a half here. I just wanted to get something out there because I'm not doing a live stream or anything today. Let you know where my head is at. And uh, if you guys have some plays you're, you're thinking about, maybe toss that in the comments. 
or some thoughts on uh, maybe on on the PS or sorry the EVFM situation. I guess there uh, a couple other decent volume runners would be Agile Therapeutics AGRX and EPZM Epizyme. I haven't even looked at them, but I would imagine they're same. They're in the same circle as uh, EVFM. All right, cheers, guys.